Hi, today I'm going to show you two ways to load sound into a flash file. Um, to find more tutorials, links, um, articles, please check out the website at www.freeadobeflashtutorials.com. If you have any questions, comments, um, feel free to email me at freeadobeflashtutorials at gmail.com. Okay, before we get started, so say we wanted to load this mp3 file into a, a flash file. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make a folder just to keep everything organized to put my whole project in. So I just put my, my sound file in there. The first method I'm going to show you how to do this is without ActionScript, just a simple basic, just to put it in there. Um, and that's really easy. All you have to do is go to File, Import. I'm going to import this to my library. I'm going to find my folder, select my song. I'm not entirely sure all of the different audio uh, formats that, that Flash accepts, but I know MP3 is just a basic one that, that I stick with. Um, so you have our song now is over in our library. Basically, to play this song in this Flash file, all you have to do is drag the symbol out onto the stage. And so if we test our movie now, it should incorporate the sound. Okay, that works. Now there's a lot of reasons um, why would we rather do that in, with ActionScript. With ActionScript, you can uh, have a lot more control over the audio file that's coming in if you want to set volume levels and do other things. So we're going to go ahead and open up a new ActionScript 2.0 file. Okay, first thing um, we should probably do is save the new file in the same folder that the song is going to be in. So let's save this. Just go ahead and save this as sound.fla. It's in the same root directory as our as our file. Next, we want to find our actions panel. First thing we need to do is set a variable. And to do that, um, var and go ahead and name whatever variable it, it is. Um, I'm going to just type in sound object. And next is we set what type of variable it is. We, we're going to set it to a sound. Under sound variable is a new sound. OK, so we have a flash um, now understands that there's a variable coming in. So we're going to tell our variable to load sound, and we're going to put in quotes the command line to our, our file, so mindsong.mp3, comma, true, close, semicolon. So we have set our variable, we've told Flash that it's going to be a sound, and we've told it which sound it's going to be. And if we now save this, and test our movie by pressing Apple Enter or Control Enter, and also play our song. So two easy ways to incorporate sound or music into a flash file. Um, I'll show you later a lot of different things you can do with this. But you can, you know, turn these on and off with buttons or rollovers and those kind of things. And we, I can show you later on more um, things to do with that. But that's just two very basic ways to bring in sound. Thank you very much. Again, if um, check out the website at www.freeadobeflashtutorials.com. And if you have any questions or comments, email me at freeadobeflashtutorials at gmail.com. Thanks.